Hello everyone. Today we will see how you can change the keyboard language of your MacBook. To change the keyboard language, first you need to click on this Apple icon at the left top corner and select system settings. Now inside system settings, you need to find the keyboard section. So in this menu at the left hand side, you need to navigate to the bottom. Here you will find this keyboard section. So click on that. Now here through this section, you can manage all the settings of your keyboard. Here in this tutorial, I will tell you how you can change the input language of your keyboard. Okay. So to change the language, you need to find the text input section. Here in text input section, you need to click on edit. Now here, as you can see, I have one default input language for my keyboard. To add more language to it, you need to click on this plus icon from here. This will display the list of all the language supported by your MacBook. You can select one of the language that are available over here. So for an instance, if I select German language, it will display all the keyboard configurations available for German language like Austrian, German, German standards, Swiss German. Okay. You can select the one according to your requirement. So for instance, here I will select German standard and click on add. Okay. So as you can see over here, German standard has been added to my list of keyboard languages. Next thing is you need to make sure that this show input menu in menu bar option is enabled. It will help you to change the input language at any time from the top menu bar. If this option is disabled on your MacBook, please enable it and then click on done. Finally, you need to close this window. Now to change the language, what you need to do on the top menu bar, you will now find one option over here. This will allow you to change your language from your existing language to the new language that you have added. Okay. So here, if you want to change your keyboard input language to German, you have to select that and you can start working on it. So that's it for now. If the video helped you in any way, don't forget to like it. And for more such video on Mac OS, please subscribe to our channel till next time. Goodbye.